Top 5 Alternative Versions of the Mona Lisa Hello and welcome to another of my videos. If you are a lover of paintings then you will enjoy this video. The Mona Lisa painting by Leonardo da Vinci is the most famous painting of all time. This valuable masterpiece has also been reinterpreted by other artists. Here are the top 5 alternative versions of the Mona Lisa. Number 5 Mona Lisa Bazooka In 2007, in Soho, London, Banksy created his very own reinterpretation of the Mona Lisa. He painted the Mona Lisa holding a bazooka. Banksy is regarded as the most famous street artist in the world. Most of his graffiti often pops up in unexpected places. Because of his skills, most of his works can sell for millions. Even though the painting did not go down well with some people, it still looks cool to behold. Number 4 Mona Lisa Smoking a Pipe In 1882, an exhibition was put on in Paris called Arts in Coherence. It featured only work by artists who didn't know how to draw. One of the contributors was an artist known as Sepek, real name Eugène Bataille. Sepek's Mona Lisa is shown smoking a pipe and puffing out rings of smoke. Sepek was known for his eccentricities that preempted performance art. He had a habit of walking around the city with his head painted blue. Number 3 Self-Portrait Mona Lisa by Dali Salvador Dali was one of the great surrealists and was well known for his upturned mustache. His work is instantly recognizable for the dreamscapes he conjures up featuring melting clocks or spindle-legged elephants. Dali's mustache is somewhat similar to the facial hair Duchamp painted on his version of the Mona Lisa. He not only put his mustache on his own upper lip, but he also put his whole face on the Mona Lisa. Dali appears looking swivel-eyed and clutching a pile of coins, perhaps to suggest the the madness of the huge amounts paid for classic works of art. In 1962, it was assessed at $100 million, nearly $1 billion today. Hash 2 liters.h.o.o.q In the early 20th century, Marcel Duchamp scandalized and revolutionized the art world. When he began producing his ready-mates, Marcel Duchamp reinterpretation of the Mona Lisa was quite unique. He used a postcard version of the painting and drew on a pointed mustache and small goatee beard. He labeled it LHOOQ. When these letters are read out in French, they sound like LHOOQAL, meaning she has a hot ass. His idea of this was that no matter how great a work of art is perceived to be, it remains an object that can be played with. Number 1 Monia a la Mace Money Mace is considered the da Vinci of doodlers. He is also regarded as the master with the ballpoint pen. Using nothing more than ordinary pens, he crafts illustrations and what he calls paintings. His most famous work is Monia a la Mace, a Mona Lisa in ballpoint. Mace was commissioned by the Pilot Pen Company to create a version of the Mona Lisa. Mona a la Mace once hung in Pilot's offices, its current whereabouts are unknown. We are sure it is kept safe since he was paid thousands of dollars to make it. We hope you enjoyed this video. Do let us know which of the top 5 you feel is insane in the comments section. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Love you all.